Hey guys, it's John, your Tennessee flying farmer. This is gonna be a, a even more short video today because, well, I'm just tired. Anyway, we are on day 14 of the December build challenge and don't have a whole lot, but I did get just a little bit done tonight before I'm, I'm gonna call it quits. Um, real quick, let's get to it. This guy's good. Now, here's our farmer, John Humbred. Look at that. Oh my God. That was Whoa. good. Where I left off yesterday, I was just getting started on these door frames. Um, I've got, of course, the piano hinges there, and I've got the top tube all fit up nicely. I've got the the back tube and, and the front tube are pretty much ready. I think I have them trimmed really close. This tube goes along the bottom. I still have to do a little bit of trimming on it to get it just right, but I did get my spacers taped on here, so I've got I can get the gap just right. Um, so yeah, that's about as far as I've got. I have been sitting here pondering over this whole heat system even more. Um, thank you guys for the comments and everything. That's it, It's always good to have people leaving comments and giving you ideas you may or may not have had. And I've had a couple of comments that have given me thoughts that have made me think about which way, how I want to do it. So I uh, appreciate you guys. Anyway, a uh, long couple of days on the farm. I'm happy to report that we are through with our crop season for the year. So, um, of course, everything else is wide open. We've been busy with cattle and feed and all that. But maybe since the crops are out of the way, maybe, maybe spend just a little more time on this. I'm going to call it a wrap. So thank you all very much for watching. Uh, please like, subscribe, share if you feel inclined to do so. Again, I appreciate you. See you tomorrow. Bye. I'm going to skip the question and answer tonight and give you guys a little bonus with some farm footage, so we'll go right into that. We'll get started by running some feed for the cattle. Um, of course, they're hungry, so, or at least they think they are. You know, they come to the fence waiting and watching, and they're more curious than anything. Our cattle are, are well fed. They're taken care of. I don't want you guys to think that they're actually just standing there hungry or anything. So and then we go right into the process of mixing feed and running feed all at the same time. And things can get kind of, well, you can see me going back and forth here. Things can get pretty hectic trying to get everything going and trying to get caught up and done in a day. I've got two tractors running, augers running, silo and loaders running. I was putting grain in that mixer there a minute ago. Now I'm putting silage into the mixer. That's corn silage. It would basically take the entire plant and chop it up. So that's the entire corn plant mixing it there now it's getting mixed up with the grains and then once it's mixed it gets actually poured into a feed wagon that ultimately gets taken to the cattle you see the feed going in into it out of the mixer the group of calves need a little more energy as they're as they're growing so they get corn silage mixed with the other grains and some other nutrients we give them all farm raised everything's raised right here on the farm and fed to the cows that are also raised right here on the farm you can see they're coming up. They love their feed. They crowd the wagon and stuff their mouths full every time you come through the gate with it. So they're happy now. We also started our calving season. First calves of the season were born here. When they start having calves, we check on them at least twice a day. And the same day they're born, we will catch the calves and give them tags and look at them good, make sure they're okay. Um, all the records and that kind of stuff is, is already getting getting set for them so we can keep up with them and make sure they're going to have a healthy life here be taken care of you can see after this one's been tagged it's I mean it's, it doesn't mind at all it's almost like an ear piercing it just gets right up and goes right back to nursing I am also happy to report that we are now completely done with our crop season for the year um, we've finished up with the combine. We finished up with planting the wheat. You can see here we're about to make the last couple of passes with our big sprayer. It's really nice to get this out of the way. We have to winterize this sprayer um, end of the year, every year, just so it doesn't freeze because there's a lot of a lot of lines and pumps and seals and all kinds of stuff that can cause trouble when it, if it freezes and busts or anything like that. So it's nice to get that completely wrapped up and put up for the year. Then my last stop for the day, I'll go and check on the other group. And we've got one pretty good little buddy in this group. You can see she's pretty friendly. The calves at this stage are very curious, so they all come up and sniff and wonder what's going on and check you out. And 
they want the camera too, or at least this one does. It's fun. It, it makes the whole day better when you can be around cows. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will catch you tomorrow. Thank you.